It's an hour travel from London to Amsterdam. It's a short three days trip since we really just plan to see the city center. I recommend to buy a travel card that you can use for your entire trip. We actually got the card for free because there was a nice guy who approached us in the airport whilst we tried to buy the ticket. We probably looked so confused and he saw us, he said he still got a free day trip on his card and literally gave it to us and even explained how far we can travel with it. We booked a hotel that is close or walking distance to everywhere. The hotel was clean and perfect for a short trip. It's also one of the cheapest that I found in booking.com that is really close to the city center. We felt safe and the check-in check-out process is so easy that you don't really need to see the receptionist. And this is the hotel, it's called Weber Hotel. We arrived a little late from London and had a quick walk in the Redland area that night and this is me the next day. I have to warn you that they have a really steep stairs here. We went out around 9am to see everything that we wanted to see and Ed Sheeran is here to say hi in the vlog! If you want to solo the best picture worthy places, you should go early because there is not much people around. You can literally see everything here. It's one of the best cookies I have ever tried and it's called Van is the Pill Cookie. I don't know if I pronounce it right but that's, yeah, that's the one. If you want to try their viral sweets here, don't have any breakfast yet because their sweets are going to fill you up. And of course, we also need to try their famous stoop waffles. <laughs> It's our second day and we are going to Zandam to see the structural hotel. We went out a little bit to see the windmills and the structural hotel away from the city center. We arrived in Zandam and paid for 7 euros for a back and forth train ticket. Sadly, we didn't search enough about this place. We thought there is more to see but end up just taking few pictures in front of the hotel and left. After Zandam, we just decided to go straight to the windmills. We sat and ate some pancakes first before we decided to walk closer to the windmills. Not worth to buy the tickets you see online because this place is totally free. If you want to see more like pictures, you can follow me on my Instagram at Niza triple A underscore. This is not London Bridge, but we saw a vessel, a ship, or a boat passing through that bridge. It's just so cool to see that. After that long trip, we went back again to Red Light area or the Wallen to find a good place to eat. We also visited a museum if you're a little bit curious about their prosti in the area. I will definitely recommend Amsterdam, the vibe is just really vibing. And that's all, see you again in my next vlog, thank you so much for watching.